Welcome back to The Graham Stephan Show. So I've posted a few episodes like this in the past, and it's gonna go one of two ways, okay? E either people get really triggered, or they really enjoy the commentary and the episodes. So I don't know which one you're gonna fall on, but I do find these incredibly interesting. Now, for those unaware, Support Court with Judge Von B basically takes these child support cases, and uh, she hears both sides. Usually one side is a little, you know, more than the other side. Uh, and then she mediates the situation. So essentially, you're able to be a fly in the wall, watching in on this case, and it's usually a train wreck. So with that said, you guys, uh, I would love if you subscribe and hit the like button for the YouTube algorithm. You could also comment down below and let me know your thoughts on the whole situation. I do my best to read all the comments. So with that said, you guys, thank you so much. And now, let's begin. Mr. Boy? Yes? You brought this case before the court. What's going on? So uh, uh, recently, I uh, was demoted. And so uh, I'm not making as much money, so trying to not pay as much money. Dog the Bounty Hunter is looking good these days. I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm still in the same job. I just got a worse part of the job. So basically I have to clean poop all day um, and make sure it doesn't get in the water so whenever you're drinking you don't have poop or hepatitis or anything like that in your water. Uh, I gotta, I gotta, I literally gotta sort it out. So when you get it, it's good. <laughs> this description of that is, uh, is great. I, I just imagine this like assembly line of just like 20 people going, <laughs> just like picking it up. There's no way that's done by hand, right? There's no way. There are so many ways to automate that. Uh, just, just with filters and just like, meshes and guards and just collect it. There's no way he's just like, just picking it out, you know, right? I hope not. And then someone's drinking it on the other end. But you know what? Not all heroes wear capes. He provides a, a great service. Without him, tap water, like this coffee would not exist. I use tap water in my coffee. So uh, yeah, we'll, we'll leave it at that. Uh, okay. Yeah. I won't drink that. No, no, you can. I made sure that there was no, uh, it's good. Okay. All because right. of me, yeah. But okay, I well, get paid you. less now, so. I'll make sure when I drink water from now on to thank Mr. Boyd. You're welcome. I like how he's taking credit for this, like the tap water that everybody drinks. He's like, yeah, that was me. You uh, brush your teeth that night, you use tap water, you're welcome. He's lacking on his duties as the father. He um, also has another child with another woman. So I really don't think he's budgeting his money or time well, and I'm not gonna accept his reduction. Yeah, but you know what? Him having a child with another another person doesn't really affect her, does it? I mean, in terms of his responsibilities, like one is one, and then if he wants to, you know, do whatever he wants to on, on the side. <laughs> Just saying, I mean, it shouldn't affect her, you, you would think, hopefully. You don't believe he's budgeting right? No, I don't. I think he's spending all his money on his new fiance and shoes. So you're mad about that? Um, yeah, I'm pretty mad about it. This would be a perfect segue for a sponsor like Mint.com or even like Rocket Money. Like guys, you don't want to be in a situation like him where you're not budgeting. Check out Rocket Money down below in the description. You're not sponsoring this. I'm just saying, if, if we could get a Rocket Money sponsorship like right here, it would be so great. But instead, all, all I got for you is a free stock down below in the description with our sponsor, public.com, when you make a deposit with the code Graham, because that could be worth all the way up to $1,000. So there you go, guys, you get something. You said he has another child. So even without a reduction in what he makes, that requires an adjustment right there. Him having another child entitles him to get his child support adjusted. No, wait, what? Okay, so let me get this straight. Let's just say he's making $4,000 a month, and of that, $1,500 a month goes to one child. If he has another child, does he just take that in half and now it's like $750 for both? Or it must get cheaper, right, for the number of children he has. So what's stopping him from having 10 kids and just paying like $100 a month to each, you know? I don't know. It makes sense though, he's, he's not Jerome Powell. He can't just print money because he wants to. By law, he has a right to ask for a reduction in child support. And by your own admission, you gave me a second reason why he qualifies for it. I mean, I don't really understand because we almost make the same amount of money, so. Right, right. But he's the one court ordered to pay child support, right? So 
your income has nothing to do with what he makes. It's a little odd though. Uh, you know, what if they have split custody and they both make the same income? Should is there is there ever a situation where she would be entitled to pay him? What if the situations were reversed and he was the one making less money? Would he still owe child support in that case? Very interesting when you really dig into it. Usually it has to do with custody and who's spending more time with the child. And that's something we don't have the details on here. What are you doing with the money? I'm supporting Ricky, our child. By support, what are you doing for him? Pay for his private school. Okay. I pay for almost everything. Okay, what are you using it for on yourself? Nothing. Ooh, trick question there. Imagine she's like, my hair extensions. Uh, no. It sounds like, though, that she is the, the primary caretaker of the child, and in doing so, she's going to incur most of the expense that should be paid for by him. But again, we don't have the full details here, but it sounds like she has f almost full custody. You were using all $850 for the child only? Yes. Okay, because this, it, it sounded like it was for another reason why you're so upset. I, or is I'm, it just because of the new girlfriend? Could be both. Oh, okay. Oh man, why is she talking? She needs someone on her side just to tell her, to, just to be quiet. She's just digging herself in a grave here because there's no way. She can't say like, oh, my feelings are hurt and I'm angry and therefore I'm asking for more money. She needs to say, my expenses went up. I believe he's making more money and can afford more. He had another child, but I also believe that he could afford more because my child's expenses are going up. So like something like that, not because she's angry. You have two kids giving you credit for your other child that brings your percentage down and your new child support amount is going to be $476.94. Part of me thinks, why should she bear the cost of him having more children? I mean, let's think objectively here, right? If she's spending all $850 on the child, and let's just assume she's telling the truth, we have no reason to doubt her at that point, $850 a month, okay? Why should she now get penalized because he's having more kids when the cost of their child should stay the same? Like, his expenses don't go down because now the father has another kid, right? It seems a bit odd. I mean, I, I get why they do it because they can't just have him just printing money all the time, but I, I don't know. It, it almost seems like the, the support should stay the same. He doesn't like football. Oh, and that, okay. And that really, that really, uh, if I didn't like football, my, my father would probably have disowned me. And so he doesn't like football, and I think she's trying to, you know, get him into like other stuff, like I don't know, cheerleading or something. I don't know. And I just, it hits me right here. Yeah. Jeez, what? All right. It hurts my feelings too because I love football. Maybe you should encourage that. Thank you. You're welcome. Anything further? Okay. You all are dismissed. So as usual, of course, we gotta go to the comments and see what they had to say about all of this. As a civil engineer for water treatment, his description of how water is cleaned is absolutely astonishing. <laughs> I, love, I love this one. It's so rudimentary and ancient. And then Jonathan Lopez says, I have certs for mold, bacteria, and biohazard. I laughed so hard when he said he had to shift it with his hands. Like, no way, bro. Oh my God. Gosh. This judge needs to be president. I would vote for her, lol. Her attitude and intelligence is what all judges slash political servants should aspire to be. I agree, I, I would vote for her. Judge Von to be for president, why not? So with that said, you guys, thank you so much for watching. As always, feel free to add me on Instagram. And like I mentioned, you can get a free stock with all the way up to $1,000 with our sponsor, public.com. When you use the link down below, then make a deposit with the code Graham. Enjoy. Let me know which stock you get. Thank you so much for watching. And until next time.